Hi guys, I'm Tim from Your6 Studios. Are you having problems with your computer stuttering, lagging, and shutting down due to overheating problems when you're playing video games and rendering videos in Sony Vegas Corral Ultimate Adobe Premiere? Well, I've had that problem and I found a solution that worked and helped keep my heat levels in my computer lower. And my computer as a result hasn't been shutting down. Let's go ahead and show you what I did to fix that now. Also, if you guys aren't aware, you can go ahead and get this free program called Core Temp, which will allow you to see your PC's temperature at all points in time. If this is your first time watching a Your6 Studios video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. I do a lot of gaming related content like Black Ops 4, Fortnite, and also a lot of tech help videos. The top right hand side of the screen is Core Temp. Go ahead and monitor that. My temperature should stay under 100 degrees Fahrenheit throughout this. So what did I do to reduce the temperature in my PC? It's fairly easy. What you need to do is go to this Windows button down here on the bottom left hand side of the screen. Go to Settings. Once setting opens up, go to System. Then from there you're going to want to go down to Power and Sleep. Go over to Additional Power Settings. Then I currently have it on Balance Recommended. Now how I came across this was I was in my video editor running, uh, rendering videos and I was on high performance and, and my computer com would constantly cut off when it was around 60% complete and uh, I didn't realize this was an overheating issue at first until I uh, downloaded CoreTemp after I did a little bit of research online and uh, my uh, computer would be heating up to like 150, 160 degrees Fahrenheit and then shutting down from there. Uh, once I got core temp on and I realized it was an overheating issue. So as a result of that, I started playing around with my power options and uh, I went down to power saving, went into my video editor, started rendering a video. And I did one on 1080p, 60 frames per second. And this would usually shut down my computer fairly quickly within you know, 20 to 30 percentage completion. And uh, I went to power saving options and my computer did not shut down. I was pretty much amazed how I was on high performance before and my computer was shut down and then I went to power saving and my computer would render things that it wouldn't render before. So as a result of that I went to the change plan settings here and started looking into it further. I went to change advanced power settings from there and this little thing popped up and then I went down to processor power management, maximum processor state. That was at 100% on high performance before, and I lowered it down to 90%. This little deduction in power setting uh, processor state of just 10% lowered my computer's temperature by 30 to 40 degrees. Uh, I was able to render videos. Uh, I was able to play video games and live stream at the same time without my PC crashing on me. Uh, I did have to lower my settings in the game options, however, uh, because I don't I don't have that maximum uh, PC power state anymore. So if you're on high performance, go ahead and go to balance and reduce that maximum power state to 90%. Try it out there uh, in the lower if your temperatures are still a little bit too high. Also, I have my system cooling set to active and my minimum power state set to 5%. I'm hoping this video helped you guys out in terms of your crashing issues and shutting down issues you've had with your PC recently. Let me know down in the comment section below if this did help you out or if you have other solutions that other people can try. Once again, thank you guys for watching. This is Tim from Your6 Studios. If you're interested in some of my other videos, go ahead and watch them over here now.